I'd like to thank my grandfather, Sergeant Jack Gardner, who is now deceased. This would be the happiest day of his entire life. I'd like to thank my mom up here, who Who never picked me up, <clears throat> who never picked me up when I fell. She taught me how to get up when I was knocked down. I thank my uncle for always being there for me. And I thank all of you out here who fought in these wars. You have no idea how big of a deal this is to me. I was not always this strong guy, you see. Um, I went through a lot of hard times in my life to get here today. And, um, a story I'll tell you with real quick. I tried once to get in the Air Force to be an Air Force pararescueman, and I quit for fear of the water. I was 175 pounds. I left the Air Force four years later at 300 pounds. I went from 175 to 300 pounds. There's a long story in there on how that came to be. But I sat around and read a book on the Medal of Honor. And those guys, all I wanted to be was an uncommon man. In my whole life, I was not that, much worse than that. But I read stories about men like you, Doc, who had the courage to jump on grenades and stuff like that. So I came home one day from working at a job called Ecolab where I sprayed for cockroaches. I made $1,000 a month, weighing 300 pounds. And I got home and I watched a show on Discovery Channel of guys carrying boats and logs, Navy SEAL training. And I decided to make a change in my life. And I called the recruiter up, and he asked me these questions. He had to, re he had to meet a certain A, like a, like a certain height and weight limit. I was six foot one and 300 pounds. He laughed at me. Seven other recruiters laughed at me. One recruiter finally said, come on in, I'm too busy to talk to you on the phone. He didn't know how much I weighed. I walked in the recruiter's office and he looked at me and he said, you're fat and you're black. I said, I want to be a Navy SEAL. I didn't know there'd only been 35 African-American Navy SEALs at that time in over 70 years. Um, he said, I basically had to lose 106 pounds in less than three months because of my age. I was getting too old. I came back three months later, 106 pounds lighter, I, uh, thank you. And literally, I spent 18 months going through BUDS, which is a six month program. Went through three hell weeks. That is where I met Marcus Luttrell, Danny Dietz, Michael Murphy, another Medal of Honor winner. I went through hell week with all these guys, real heroes. I am not a hero. I served with real heroes. And from there, I went on to raise over $2 million for Special Operations Warrior Foundation. But I'm going to end you with this right here. I have the most respect I can possibly muster up for all of you in this room. I know what it takes to be a combat soldier. And I used to look for courage. I thought courage was a man who won the Medal of Honor. It is. But Courage is a man who's willing to put those boots on every single day of his life to go out there and fight for this country where nobody even knows what the hell they're doing or where the hell they're at. You do it for the man beside you. Thank you.